Okay, dear student, let us see what is there in this question. The gravitational field strength at the surface of the Earth is 9.8 Newton per kg. The use of this value to calculate the weight of an object above the surface of the Earth is a paradigm shift in our understanding of gravity, an attempt to model gravitational field, an outcome from a peer review, an approximation used for the estimation purposes only. I think the answer will be D because that seems to be the most suitable. Let me explain you. Uh, what is my understanding of this question? They are saying that the gravitational field strength at the surface, like in the formula, you have to use uh, the radius of the earth, which is like 6,400 kilometers to be very precise. So that value is used and you would be getting the value 9.8. But what about a little above the surface? Like let us say you are on a building, which is like kind of 200 meters above the surface of the earth, 100 meters above the surface of the earth. So what do you think? Uh, would you be using the 9.8 still? And or you should not be using it because technically speaking, the gravity is not 9.8 when you start increasing your height. Like, for example, you go to the Mount Everest. So there will be some amount of the gravity which will be lesser than this, but definitely it will not be that very different. It can be approximated to be 9.8 very easily. So uh, we can clearly say that if you want to find the weight of an object above the surface of the earth, and you are still using 9.8, which is the gravity only at the surface of the earth. Clearly, it is an approximation used for the estimation purposes only. That that much should be the force with which the earth will be pulling you uh, towards the center of the earth. So that could be the force. So clearly, in this case, the answer will be D. A, B, C do not make any sense. They are really vague. Like the peer review, it has nothing to do with it. An attempt to model gravitational field. It has nothing to do with the weight. Yes, it could be an attempt to model the gravitational field, but that is what is the work done by gravitational field strength itself. Why do you want to find weight? B is wrong. A, the paradigm shift in our understanding of gravity? Not at all. So D is the correct answer. This is my explanation. Okay, dear students, thanks for watching the video. All the best. Bye. See you in the next video.